What we're going to be doing on Soldier Reviews is taking a look at Hollywood's portrayals of soldiers in film and TV. Each episode, we're going to take at least five scenes from a movie and show and give them either a sustain if it's an accurate portrayal or an improve if they've taken a bit too much of creative license. On this episode, Robert Redford plays a general who, even in prison, wants to keep fighting for what's right in The Last Castle. Sir. You're a Sergeant Major. I was. Prisoners! Fall in! Some may think to be remembered in this way would be a disgrace to a soldier. But this is not a disgrace. The greatest monuments to fallen men are not made in marble. They're deep in the sea, deep in the jungles, on foreign battlefields. A rifle driven into the ground with a helmet on top and some tags. And that is the tribute that this man has earned. So with this scene, it gave me a little chills when Robert Redford stood on that rock wall and the Sergeant Major uh, had everyone form up. And it was funny because everyone was looking around the courtyard wondering what to do. And what do soldiers, airmen, and Marines do? They, they formed up and fell in. It was a really cool scene to watch when he gave that his little speech. So uh, it's definitely a sustain for this one. All teams, this is a full sort alert. Repeat. All teams, this is a full sort alert. No indication of anything, sir. Of course not. He'll keep it hidden till the last possible second. Go, go, go! Because you know no castle can have two. Go, 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 go! Head down! Head down! So in this scene, they had to do a little recon. So they, they took uh, Robert Redford's friend, the general, hostage. And uh, they wanted to see the steps that the prison takes uh, to stop rioting. So uh, everyone was paying attention, knew the steps, and they had to come up with a plan. It was a, a good sustain for this scene. We can no longer wear the uniform of a soldier. We forfeited that right. And that includes me. So here I am, just like you, a convicted criminal. The only difference between you and me is that I know I'm guilty. <laughs> <laughs> so we're packed away here as prisoners. They cannot take away from us who we are. And we are soldiers. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And it is the one thing, it is the one thing that gives us a chance in here. And that nobody can ever take away. Yeah, that's right. The Uniform Code of Military Justice. Grounds for removal of a stockade or disciplinary barracks commander. One, dereliction of duty. Two, criminal malfeasance. Three, non-compliance with procedural rules. Four, making false official statements. Five, Conduct unbecoming to an officer and general. Yeah. Six, cruelty and maltreatment of persons under his command. Yeah. Seven, command failure resulting in loss of control of facility. Gentlemen, I propose that we seize control of this facility. All right, so they're all in the chow hall eating, and Robert Redford needs to rile them up a little bit. So he has to give them a speech on regulations and that they want to take over to prison. And boy, did it rile everyone up. 
and everyone was ready to go. So it was, uh, again, another great speech, a good sustain. Any castle could be taken, whether you're fighting in the 14th century or the 21st. To succeed in the castle war, you have to overcome the garrison, take the high ground, and ultimately capture the flag. Okay? Enriquez. All right. You set up a command post. Okay. Right here. We've got the guard. Well, here, first of all, this is admin building, winter's office, guards. Okay? Phase one, neutralize winter's guards. Phase two, towers. Control the towers, you control the yard. Tower one, tower two, tower three, tower four, tower four is tomorrow. Got to watch. Phase three, water cannon. Four, helicopter. Helicopter's the high ground. Taking the helicopter's gonna be a bitch. Well, so now they got their plan. And of course, like other movies and soldiers, they make a sand table. And this one's a primitive sand table using chess pieces, but it does the job. And they talk about each step that the guards take in order to stop the rioting. So it was an easy sand table, and everyone knew their jobs. Everyone knew what was coming. So it was a good sustain there, too. Now. I think that's Yates. Yes, I know. All right, so in this last scene, when they're taking over the prison, there comes the chopper. Now, that was a hell of a shot with a grappling hook out of a water cannon and to get to the chopper. Not only did they lasso the chopper, but the pilot tries to scale on the rope to get to the chopper. Now, I don't know if this could happen in real life, but uh, it was a hell of a scene, and I think that needed an improve because I, I didn't see something like that really happening. All right, so with four sustains and one improve it, it was really a great movie. It, it uh, hits all the military, you know, soldiers, Marines, Navy, Air Force. They're all prisoners in the same prison, and they still work as a cohesive team. Um, the ending is great with the American flag going up. Uh, if you haven't seen this movie yet, um, take a look at it. Uh, it'll make, it's a feel-good movie. So uh, thank you for watching. Um, any comments? Please comment, and we'll answer you the best we can. Take care.